Day after NTV revealed that an independent valuation over BOC Gas Kenya argued that the takeover price by Carbacid and Aksai Investment had undervalued the company by 44%, the board of Carbacid has come out to defend the offer, terming it as a strong proposition for shareholders. Julian Zambuko now looks at the case tabled by Carbacid. A statement to NTV Kenya, signed by Chairperson Ambassador Dennis Awori. The board of Kabasid says it stands by the valuation of 63 shillings and 50 cents, translating to an aggregate valuation of 1.24 billion shillings. Kabasid's board states that the offer price relies on a valuation method, which is widely accepted as the most authoritative valuation approach of the business as a going concern. In its defense, the board of Kabasid argues that the offer price represents a premium as of the 24th of November 2020 of 4 shillings and 67 cents or 7.94 percent higher than the 30-day volume weighted average price per share. The board goes further to state that at 63 shillings and 50 cents, BOC Kenya shareholders have been offered a premium of 6 shillings and 62 cents or 11.64 percent higher than the 90-day volume weighted average price per share. Kabasid further argues that the irrevocable acceptance of the offer by the majority shareholder UK-based BOC Holdings should be viewed as a definitive validation of the offer. Shareholders of BOC Kenya now have until the 6th of April 2021 to determine whether to accept the offer of 63 shillings and 50 cents from Kabasid and Aksai Investments. The deal is expected to be consummated by the 31st of July 2021. Julian's Amboko. NTV.